started at football so young. I went to Rochdale when he's like he's when you're eight years old, and then you made your professional day at just the age of fifteen. Rochdale's the like youngest debutant ever. Um, yeah. What's that like? Like, how do you feel it's impacted your career um, and your playing style, your performances, just being chucked straight into senior football like that? Because obviously, some clubs they go from age group to age group. They'll make it to the under twenty ones, and then after the under twenty ones, and they'll slowly get integrated into the senior scene whereas you you're 15 bang they've chucked you straight in there um and you played loads of games to them so yeah just wondering your thoughts on that uh, i think it like helped me help me mature earlier um because you know like i said people's like people um, don't necessarily realize this but people's lives are on the line season from season in league one and league two mm. um you know players Football is not a guarantee, you know, players don't have a contract every single year. So being a part of that at 15, like you said, 15, 16, where people's people's careers, people's lifestyles, people's families, you know, if you get, if a club gets relegated, your wages might get cut in half as part of your contract. You might just get released and not have anywhere to go. Mm. Um, so being trusted to be, you know, part of the 11 that's involved in that, I had to mature straight away. You know, I couldn't be a kid. I couldn't learn the game as I go as I went um and uh, people just took me under the ring you know I've, I've always said that I, I'm not where I am today solely because of me I'm here because of the people that have helped me on the way uh, and I'm forever grateful to every single one of them mm -hmm. but yeah you definitely had to I had to mature earlier to be a part of you know a, a team you know it's, it I, it was never it was never just me you know it was always just Rochdale mm 